In other news, as the weather warms up and plants bring spring to life, native species aren't the only things bringing to beginning to bloom. Invasive plants, fish, and bugs remain an issue in Michigan. There are several ways for everyone to get involved in preventing the spread of invasive species. Cooperative invasive species management areas keep track of and work to reduce or eliminate these species. The harm they do to the environment is the most tangible thing for me to see because um, what, what they do is they crowd out the space and habitat from native species and make it so that the only thing growing in that area are those plants that are the invasive. And what that leads to is a demise in the other uh, species that would normally coexist on that landscape. And, and so you lose the insects that relied on the plants that are now gone. And then you lose the birds or the amphibians that relied on those insects that are now gone. And, and so you eventually lose the ecosystem community structure that then also feeds into what we require as humans on this landscape. Learn more about how to recognize, report, and prevent invasive species spread in this story on upmatters.com.